Hi there, and welcome to my modern web scraping course with Python using Scrapy, Splash, and Selenium 2nd edition. This course was launched back in 2018, and fortunately things have changed a little bit, therefore I updated everything app. It's been completely reshot and redesigned from the ground app to give you everything you need to master web scraping using three different technologies. We're gonna use Scrapy, Splash, and Selenium. So let's take a look on what's inside this course. Now, unlike other courses, this one is fully project-based. On each section, you're gonna learn how to scrape a different website. The reason why I went with fully real-world websites is to kinda show you what are the challenges that you may come across, whether for your personal or your freelancing projects. So first thing first, you're gonna learn about all the available scrapy commands and how to use them, and you're gonna build your first basic spider from the beginning. You will learn XPath and CSS selectors, these two are used to select elements from HTML web pages. In fact, everyone starting with web scraping kind of finds some difficulties remembering XPath expressions and CSS selectors. This is why I included a cheat sheet that you can keep on your pocket and take it as a reference in case you forget something. Not only that, I also included an assignment to help you practice what you've learned. So as you can see, this course is not only about learning web scraping. It's also designed to help you memorize and understand the key fundamentals to master web scraping. Now with that all and after you have gained a solid knowledge on XPath and CSS selectors, you're gonna learn how to select and extract data from websites and then turn that data into a data set in which you can use for data analysis and visualization projects. Next, you're gonna learn how to follow links using Scrapy, how to handle scraping multiple pages at the same time, and you're gonna learn about all the available types of spiders that Scrapy can offer and which one to use based on the scenario you are in. Next, more importantly, I'm gonna show you how to scrape JavaScript-based websites using two different technologies like Splash and Selenium. And guess what? I even included a crash course on both Splash and Selenium. Now, if you are completely new to web scraping, you may ask why JavaScript websites? Well, simply because the spider, which is the component that scrapes the web, can't interpret JavaScript because it's a client-side language that requires a browser to be executed. This is why we have to use third-party apps like Splash and Selenium, along with Scrapy to scrape that kind of websites. Finally, you're gonna learn about the concept of pipelines and middlewares, means you're gonna learn how to export the data to a database like MongoDB and SQLite 3, and how to spoof request headers and some best web scraping practices. Now, before I'm gonna end up this video, I'm not that type of guy who likes to talk about himself a lot, but let me introduce myself to you in case you are interested. So my name is Ahmed, I'm a web developer and web scraping expert. In the past few years, I was able to deliver and accomplish many successful web scraping projects to my clients. So trust me, you are in safe hands to learn and master web scraping. So I hope to see you enrolled in my course.